At the end of the first chapter of Mark's Gospel, you'll find one of my favorite healing stories. Hello, Father James Kabicki here, and the story concerns a leper who came up to Jesus and said, If you wish, you can make me clean. The man was desperate to be healed and to be able to return to his family and community. Commenting on this, Pope Francis said, Moses, in his legislation regarding lepers, says that they are to be kept alone and apart from the community for the duration of their illness. Imagine how much suffering and shame lepers must have felt physically, socially, psychologically, and spiritually. They are not only victims of disease, but they feel guilty about it, punished for their sins. Theirs is a living death. In addition, lepers inspire fear, contempt, and loathing, and so they are abandoned by their families, shunned by other persons, cast out by society. Indeed, society rejects them and forces them to live apart from the healthy. It excludes them, so much so that if a healthy person approached a leper, he would be punished severely and often be treated as a leper himself." End quote. So what does Jesus do when this leper comes into such close contact with him? He reaches into his isolation and actually touches him, saying, I do will it, be made clean. In touching the leper, Jesus made himself unclean according to Mosaic law. The law was good, for it was designed to prevent the spread of disease. But Jesus, the Son of God, is the giver of the law and is not bound by it. His loving mercy reaches out to all as he takes upon himself the sins of the world.